I think it's scared of me. I don't want anyone. This is no t I've got work to do. Blasting plunger used to detonate explosives remotely. Looks like Skinny over here never got the chance to use it. Doubt he'll notice if it goes missing. It says it's a Wonga Isle tax law. I say 2,000 pages of mind numbing boredom. But I guess I'll pick it up anyway. Well, this isn't very encouraging. My, but what fine teeth he has. There's a block of stone protruding from the water. I should use this on something explosive. I can't stop here. This is bad country. I should use this on something. Those don't. Those. Those don't go together. I don't want any. I don't want any. This is no t I've got work to do. This is no time. I've got work to do. I think it's scared of me. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that here. of my stuff what are you doing in my house the name's voodoo detective I'm a voodoo private investigator I'm just trying to get my bearings I washed up here not too long ago making yourself at home on someone else's island eh? you are a bad person do you mind if I ask you some questions but I do mind can you not see I am busy? Go away, shoot! Hey, hands off my stuff! I already told you I am busy. Hey, hands off my stuff! Hey, hands off my Sacre bleu! Where did you get that necklace? You've seen this before? But of course! It belonged to my wife! Your last name wouldn't happen to be Lamoon, would it? Ah, uh, I see my renown has not diminished. <laughs> yes, I am the Francois Lemoon. No autograph, s'il vous plaît. Now you will tell me where you acquired my wife's locket. Uh, locket? Just push the button at the top, you see? It contains a picture of our beautiful daughter, Genevieve. This is your daughter. Yes, she is lovely, is she not? Well, this locket was given to me by my client, Mary Fontoul. 
Fontu! That name is a foul curse! One must spit it out like a piece of rotten beef! Yeah, the thing is, that's Mary Fontu's picture in the locket. What are you talking about? I've got some bad news for you. Your daughter and Victor were man and wife. Oh, gross! He is so old! Wait, what do you mean, well? She's dead. Mon dieu! She takes after her father. <laughs> ah, I, I need a moment. Nice digs. You build this place? Ah, she is magnificent, is she not? When I first arrived at Ile Francois, it was nothing more than a moldering wreck. But I took this house here and I made it into a silk purse. I call it Chateau du Francois. Ah, it would be my chef d'oeuvre if only I had been able to finish the hot tub. I found your journal. It says Victor invited you and your wife to his yacht. That you had concerns over changes made to your family recipe. The entries stop after that. What happened? Oh, it makes me ill to think of it. Victor indeed invited us to his yacht. But when we arrived, we found he had taken our daughter Geneviève hostage. He threatened to kill her if we did not immediately sign over our rights to Island Kitchen. Of course, we did as he asked. We signed the papers to save our child. But before the ink could dry, Victor pulled out a gun and started firing. While he was busy shooting my wife, I jumped overboard. So Victor killed your wife, hexed your daughter, and left you for dead. Oh, what a despicable man. So you jumped off Victor's yacht and washed up here. How did you die? An unfortunate tragedy. I was trying to expand the plumbing for my house, uh, putting in that hot tub. I tried to tap the lake at the top of the mountain, but I had a little dynamite accident. <laughs> Made quite a mess up there. What's it like being dead? It is exactly like being alive, except you don't have to pay taxes. How involved were Theodore and Gordon in the kidnapping of your daughter? Those two craven rats stood by and watched Victor destroy my family. In my opinion, they are equally complicit. I hope Crumsford eats a bullet and Lawton melts entirely. I don't suppose you know a way off this island. I don't know. Maybe. You mean you might know a way off? Ah, I wish I could help you off this island. Perhaps then you could take care of that connard, Fontu. But alas, I have unfinished business. What do you mean? My aqueduct must be completed. I cannot live here until my hot tub works. I put so much effort into that thing. So, if I get your hot tub working, You'll get me off this island? Absolument. I swear on my wife's grave. I'll be back later. Hey, and... You want your hot tub filled, right? Well... Well, I can't help you without some of these items. <sighs> Very well, then. Take what you need. And once I'm finished... You can help me off this island, right? Absolutely! The pot is empty. It says world's best castaway. Looks like it's made of pyrite. For a dead man, he sure has a healthy ego. This looks like a hot tub, but it's empty. 
Those don't go together. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. I've got enough charcoal. Never know when you might need a sturdy cup. The cupboard is chock full of cook a bunch of cereal. Wonder if the ship was run by a horde of children. That won't help here. I have great plans for my little charcoal friend, but not here, not now. I have great plans. I'm not wasting this. It's the Zowangan family Robinson. Someone's really set up shop here. I think it's scared of me. I'll miss the sea, but a person needs new experiences. I can't use that here. Won't help here. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that. I should use this on something explosive. I should use. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. A little charcoal ought to heat things up. Those don't go together. 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 The aqueduct runs from here to the shipwreck on the beach. I think it's scared of me. That won't help here. Can't use that. That won't help here. I can't use that here. That won't help here. That won't help here. I can't use that. Won't help here. Can't use that here.
Yum. I think it's scary. Nothing says I'm not going to hurt you like a handful of kookabunches. Ah. I'm tickled. The Zowangan family. That won't help here. I've got enough. I can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that. That won't help here. If I look over the edge, I can just make out the aqueduct. Can't use that here. I should use this on something explosive. I should use this. I should use it. Those. Those don't. Those don't. Those. Says the Wonga Isle Tax Law, Chapter One. This chapter summarizes the significant tax legislation impacting the Zawanga Isle Department of Revenue. It was approved during the 1918 regular session of Zawanga Isle Legislature. Research and fiscal analysis divisions are not intended. No, I'm sorry. I can't read anymore. This is mind-numbing. I'll have to come back to it later. My mind's still numb from the last time I cracked this thing open. Those don't go together. 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 Those. Those don't. Those don't. Those. Those don't. Those. Those don't. Won't help here. I can't use that here. This sans teeth, sans eyes, sans taste, sans everything. That 
won't help you. That doesn't... I should use this on something expl... I should... I should use this on something... This rock is caked in guano. You never know when you need bad crap. Guano gives the dish a kick. Whatever you say, Grammy. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. But there's no one. I've got to. Um, I'll be back. There's a mechanic, but there's nothing to cook. I don't need. I don't need any. Can't use. That won't help here. won't help. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that. That won't help here. That's no place. That doesn't, that doesn't need to be tickled. I can't use that here. Time to make my award-winning soup. There's a mechanical starter for the stove. No need for matches. There we are, nice and hot. Oh man, that stinks. Pyrite melted into slag. That won't help here. I can't use that. That won't help here. I can't use that. I'm not wasting this. I should use. I should use it. The pyrite melted into slag. Vapor from the melted pyrite condensed on the hood. There's a stinky sulfuric residue. I think I'll scoop some into my pockets. This probably counts as brimstone. I think that's it. Just like Grammy used to make. If I can buy these in my inventory, I'll blow myself up. I should use this on something. I should use... That won't help. Can't use that. That won't help here. I better step back.
just like Grammy used to make. It's time for Francois to hold up his end of the bargain. All right, Napoleon blown apart. Now that your tub is bubbling, how about you help me off this hunk of rock? I would if only I could. Si la vie. What? I thought once your business was finished, you'd be ready to leave this place. That you could get me off this island. I didn't say that. Oh, come on. Don't get mad at me. I am but the humble ghost of a renowned master chef. What am I supposed to do, dummy? You're the voodoo detective. Maybe you should ask the spirits for help. Well, that might not be such a bad idea. Now go away. I am relaxing. Statues look ancient. I wonder who put them here. These statues. Hmm. This looks like an Asan. A dry gourd surrounded by loose netting used for voodoo ceremonies. Usually the netting has beads in it, but they're missing. There's a small clay pot. This is a Hunfo, a voodoo place of worship. The central pillar represents the connection between this world and the realm of spirits. Think of it like a spiritual telephone. Each loa has a veve, a phone number. When you draw a veve at the base of the pillar, it's like dialing that number. Those don't go together. Those. Those don't. Those don't go together. Those. It says Zawanga Isle Tax Chapter 1. This chapter summarizes. It was approved during the ninth research and fiscal and I can't read it. Can't use that. I'm not putting I've got enough. Yeah, whatever. Francois lied. I don't know what possessed me to help that shady chef. I guess only the Loa can save me now. I've got to hand it to Francois. That looks pretty relaxing. Those don't go together. 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 
Those don't go together. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. It's the rum Barb wanted me to have. Those. Those don't go together. 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 That's no place to lay down the law. Are you kidding? That won't help here. I can't use that here. That doesn't need... Your Fabe draw on a perfect sign. More than anyone, I need to reach Papa Legba. He'll know what to do. This is a humfo, a voodoo. That won't help here. That doesn't need to be tickled. I've got an asan, but it's missing beads from the netting. I need to replace those first. Can't use that here. I'm not wasting. I've got an asan, but it's missing beads from the netting. I need to replace those first. That won't help here. I can't use that here. That won't help here. These statues look ancient. These sta Maybe I can replace the missing rattles with these teeth. They have a nice sound to them, actually. I've never asked much of the lower, but I could really use some help right now. Your Veve draw on a perfect sign. The Asan shakes to keep the time. A call that sounds in holy ears. We dance until our guest appears. Well, that didn't do anything. Oh boy. I was wrong. Oh, where am I? It's a statue of Papa Legba, but it looks wrong, like something's missing. I can't use that here. That won't help here. That doesn't need... I'm not wasting this. I don't want anyone... no place to live are you the statue of Victor is holding a box he seems pleased with there's an inscription on the box pain visits the flesh but makes its home in the mind let's just see what's inside this puppy oh oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, ouch! Mm, it felt like the skin was melting right off my bones. But my hand is fine. I guess the pain was all in my mind. It's a statue of Victor. There's an... Oh. My hand... That doesn't need... It's 
a statue of Victor holding a straw hat. He's got a look on his face like a naughty child. There's something written here. The clock conducts a marching tune. First left, then right. It starts at noon. Beneath the inscription is a series of musical notes. It's Gordon. I'm surprised he's not made of gold. I can move the arms. is going to pay for what he did to you. It's Theodore. Poor little weasel. It's a statue of me. Not too shabby. The statue. He's got a look on his face. There's something. The clock conducts a marching tune. First left, then right. It starts at noon. Beneath the inscription is a series of. Statue of Victor. He's clutching an old man's cane with a gleeful look in his eye. There's an inscription here. A mirthful belt will quickly melt what sadness has in store. The key to hold a chest of gold is nice, but I'm worth more. Sounds like I need to find a way to make old Stoneface laugh. Let's see if this guy's ticklish. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that. Those don't go together. Those don't go together. <laughs> that 
statue of That won't help here. I can't use that. That won't help here. Those. Those. That won't help here. Are you... I'm not waste. That's no. It says chapter one. This I can't read anymore. I should really. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Let's see. What a strange... I guess I did something right. I'll take that. Can't use that here. That won't help here. This ought to cover up that bald spot. It's a statue of Victor. A pain bit. Let's just... Oh! Uh... My hand. Now it's just a statue of Victor. Someone ought to tear this thing down. Can't use that here. That won't help here. Can't use that here. 
I think I'm done messing around with these statues. These statues look ancient. stop that won't help here those don't go together those don't go together those don't go together those don't got enough charcoal. The pyrite melted into... Can you... That's no... I'm not... no place to lay down the law. It says the Wonga Isle Tax Law, Chapter 1. This chapter summarizes the significant tax law. It was approved during the 1918 research and fiscal analysis. I can't read anymore. It's a statue of Victor. There's an inscription on the box. Pain visits the flesh, but makes its home in the mind. Pain makes its home in the mind, huh? Thank God for mind-numbing tax law. There's a stone pipe in the box. I'm taking it. I hate to reinforce a bad habit, but... He's looking a little better now, but there's still something missing. The cane fits. It's no Michelangelo, but at least it's wearing clothes, eh? Uh... Indeed, I am Papa Legba. I'm bored. Let's go. Hey, wait up. Your Papa Legba. That's right. I believe you have some questions for me. I'm marooned on a desert island. I have to get off somehow. Maybe think about that the next time you decide to leap from the back of a moving ship. My client's been murdered. Ah, yes. Genevieve. Nice lady. Not such a nice way to go. But you're no detective. Nothing lasts forever. You know Genevieve? 
Well, she's part of the reason you and I are talking. It was you. You gave her that pendant. Well done, detective. But why? Pull out one thread in the cosmic tapestry, and the patterns underlying the whole universe can shift. In this case, Genevieve Lamoon was that thread. Victor had erased her mind, wiped away her past. She was nothing more than a submissive trial. I woke her from her stupor and gave her a gentle nudge in your direction. And now she's dead because of me. Self-pity won't bring her back, but if you want to set things right, I have a business proposition for you. Victor's captured Baron Somdi's spirit. He's using it to harvest human souls to season his gumbo. Victor Von Thule. Yes. Let's come back to him. Victor kidnapped my brother. Yes, but the important thing is he's still alive. You mentioned a business proposition? Victor's actions have far-reaching ramifications. The land of Genin has been plunged into chaos. The dead are rising from the earth, and the living are addicted to unholy poison. We stand at a crossroads, and all paths but one lead to oblivion. Fontoul's crossed more people than the Catholic Church. Find a factory on Ventures Island, stop Victor, and restore Baron Samdi to his throne. How will I find Victor's factory? Take my sign. With it, you can traverse hidden passages across reality. You can get off this island and back on the case. So how about it, detective? All right. I guess I can pencil you in. Very well. We have a compact. Now, before I go, there's one thing I should mention about my sign. The crossroads of the universe only meet in locations with a strong connection to the spirit realm. Your best bet is a place of worship, like a Hunfo. I think I can manage that. Once you've acquired Baron Samdi's spirit, use my sign to restore him to his throne. Good luck, detective. We're all counting on you. This isn't where I parked my office. I think I'll put on a shirt before I leave. I can't stop here. It's an aqueduct that leads from the jungle to the... There's a nice steady flow. I'll miss the sea. It's the Zowangan family Robinson. Someone's really set up shop here. Those don't go together. Those don't. I think I need to use the sign on myself. Hmm, sign doesn't seem to work here. Pop hmm, sign doesn't seem to work here. Papa Legba said my best bet is to try using it near a Humfo. Nothing. 